Hello, landing lifestylers. Welcome to today's video. So today's video is what I got my kids for their birthday. I figured this would be very appropriate. Uh, two of my kids that just turned three and is about to turn two, they have birthdays right after Christmas. So it's always hard to find out like, what should I get them that I did not already get them for Christmas? So I figured this would be a great gift idea video. You guys love my Christmas ones. And this one is kind of simple in my opinion. It's nothing crazy. Like they don't each get like 10 to 15 gifts each. A lot of these things as always are from Amazon. So I'll link any Amazon links below. Both of my kids are autistic. So their development is lower than their age. So some of these things are appropriate for their age. Others are not. So I just kind of give that disclaimer if you're kind of like, oh, that's a weird gift. I got some of those comments on my Christmas video that the gifts I got were weird. Some of them are if you have a typical child, but if you don't and if you have a special needs child, this is the video for you. So kind of to start off with, we're going to start off with my three-year-old son, Liam. He turned three at the beginning of the month and we bought him quite a few little, little goodies. His big, big gift was this box of Magna tiles. He's already been playing with some of them. This is why I'm doing this video because they are tired of waiting on me. Okay. And we really don't wrap the gifts for the kids just because we had a crazy experience with it on Christmas and it just doesn't go well. They don't understand it. They don't want to unwrap it. So I'm like putting these all out for them for tomorrow. So they are going to wake up some really happy toddlers, but these are just magnet tiles. There's a hundred pieces. Magnet tiles are really, really expensive. Um, they do have off-brand ones, but I haven't heard the best things about the off-brand. I've heard that they break open easily. And then that's usually when kids like like swallow the magnets and things like that. So we always like buying the brand name magnet tiles. Uh, my mother-in-law went in on us on this gift. So she, this is partially from her too. I think this was like $120 for a hundred magnet tiles, but Liam loves them so much. Like he literally will play with them and build with them all day long. So I felt like it was worth that investment. Um, something my mom got him because he loves Play-Doh is she got him this Melissa and Doug Play-Doh set. Um, a lot of the Play-Doh play sets are a skill set higher than where Liam's at. So he wouldn't understand how to like put things in and then pull the levers down. It's a little bit more complex than where he's at. But these, this Melissa and Doug is perfect because you just use the blocks and you get to like put them in the Play-Doh, roll the pens over. It's just very simple. It does come with a few Play-Doh things, I think. Like, I think these are Play-Doh. Also, he loves his remote control car we got him for Christmas. It's like a Power Wheels, but there's a parent remote control so we can like push him around. But he likes it because when his siblings are in it, he can also use the remote control. So I got him the remote controller. The age is 18 plus, 18 months plus. And so it seems like it'd be a lot of fun. It only has like two buttons on it. So it's very easy for him to do. And I figured this would be a lot better because the issue is, is like when our other kids are in it, then he's wanting to like run them into walls and stuff. So this is a lot easier. It seemed very, very simple. So we will see how he likes it. It was a little bit pricey. So another gift we also got him is this Mrs. Potato Head. He loves the Potato Head saga series. He loves it. I like it because it encourages like play skills, but it also helps his fine motor skills too, because some of those like pieces are like hard to put in there. So this kind of just goes with this other set. He already has the Mr. Potato Head. So this is the Mrs. Potato Head and it's, it's, it's a lot. It's like 35 pieces and we saw it and just knew that we would love it. I also love it because it comes with a container and I love anything that comes in a container. Penelope, my almost two year old, she'll be two this Thursday. Um, she's not getting as much in quantity because a lot of the things we've gotten her, um, 
is really big and I'm, I'm going to kind of explain what this is her and Liam's this is going to Penelope because she loves bath time so 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 much but I'm sure Liam will play with it too because it's in the bathtub we do buy gifts that are specific to kids but we also like to incorporate sharing and things like that so we don't make it like that strictly that kid's toy unless it's something like very very special to them I guess um, but this is just a bathtub toy that I saw on a channel, I think it was like pink and blue or something. If I can find the channel, I'll link it. But she had mentioned it in her what she got our kids for Christmas video. And it basically goes on the side of the tub and it has little spinny things. It has water that spouts out. And Penelope loves the bathtub. She loves just stimming. That's her sensory place. And so I figured this would be just perfect for her for bath time. And I can't wait for her to try it out it has like different cups and and all kinds of all kinds of different things here that shows you a little bit better and then that shows you Penelope's harder because she got a lot of laugh and learn toys for Christmas so I didn't want to just buy her a bunch of Christmas stuff so I wanted it to be something that I feel like she would be really really happy with and love so the first thing we got her is this Leap, leapfrog uh, scoop and learn ice cream cart. She loves things like this. Um, it's really simpler to the uh, Fisher Price Laugh and Learn series where it's kind of like educational, but it's fun at the same time. Um, my friend Emily, uh, it's Our Wonderful Life, I'll link her. She had gotten one for her kids and we went over her house the other day and my five-year-old loved it, Penelope loved it. And so I figured this would be a perfect, perfect birthday gift for her. And I'm excited to put it together and let her try it out. It's just like just the ice cream truck. So much fun. My five-year-old was trying to get me to open it tonight. I'm like, no, honey, not yet. So that's going to be a lot of fun to do. Um, I got that from Target. I think it was like $35 to $40. The other gift I can't show you because one, it's not here yet. And two, it's too big, is we are getting her a big girl bed. And this is the one we're getting it from Walmart. We're getting it very, very simple because hopefully next year we will be building a house. And when we build a house, we plan to get her like new furniture, like a whole furniture set for her room and all of that. Um, so I didn't want to invest too much money in it. She hates her toddler bed. She won't sleep on her toddler bed. If there's nothing else available for her, like if we've closed up her brother's bed, she can't get into his bed, she'll sleep on the floor. She prefers the floor over her bed. She does not like it, but she likes just regular twin size beds. And so I figured this will be really, really great for her. And we will have to get her the side rails so hopefully she doesn't fall out of it. But to kind of go with it, got her from Target, got her some mermaid sheets, which is cute. And then just, um, just a nice, Nice color. I really like the quilts from Target. They last a long time, especially with little ones when they have to be washed a lot because they get soiled. So now Liam's bed is kind of like a, it's closed in in a way. So that might be why she loves it so much. So if that becomes an issue, we may have to get like a canopy or something to kind of give her that fill. But I'm hoping just the comfort of it will help because she tries climbing and on the beds all the time just to go to sleep. And I feel like this is going to help out a lot. <laughs> because like during nap time, we, we only close up Liam's bed at night and we will constantly find them like cuddled together. <laughs> so cute, I love it. That's basically it. Um, my mom still has to get her something and then my mother-in-law is gonna get her something. So there are a few more things that should come, but honestly, I feel like really good with the things she's gotten. I didn't want to just get a bunch of junk and I feel like these are just really, really good gifts for her. And I can't believe that she's about to be two. It feels like I just had her and it just went by so, so, so fast. But we are excited to kind of throw her a little bit of a party. Um, she was late on eating. So even at her first birthday, she was still solely on formula because she wouldn't eat anything. So I'm really excited to get her a little smash cake and that's just gonna be a lot of fun to do. So we're doing that this Thursday. I'm not gonna wait, make them wait for the presents just because they really don't have a concept of that. Like 
that they have to wait to celebrate it a certain day. So every day I'll probably just like put out one of their gifts and it will just be new fun things that they can kind of play with and explore. Thank you guys for watching this video. Um, if you are interested in, in any of these items, I will link as many of them as I can below. I don't think that Amazon has the Leapfrog Scoop and Learn ice cream cart that's at Target. Um, so that's pretty easy to find. And then the bedding is from is from Target as well. So I'm excited to get her stuff in because then we can completely finish her room and I can do a room tour. Again, thank you for being patient with me. I didn't go anywhere. I've gotten lots of messages like, what happened to Landing Lifestyle? And I haven't given up on it. It's just harder with lifestyle content because it isn't like I'm just vlogging our day or I can just sit down and talk to you guys about something. Um, it's usually something I, I have to have items or I have to go out and do it. And it's just been a really, a really intense time. <laughs> so thank you for um, just being patient. If you're new here, please feel free to hit that red subscribe button. We would love for you to become a part of our Landing Lifestyle family. Oh, 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 disclaimer, disclaimer. If any of you guys were following us on you now for live streaming, because I live stream once a day, um, we've moved over to Twitch. It's our landing crew eight. You can sign up for free. You don't have to sign up for an account if you don't want to. If you just want to watch us, you can do that too. But if you are wanting to um, sign up, you can also subscribe for free. You just like link your Amazon Prime account and it allows you to subscribe to one Twitch channel a month for free so we would love for you to join us over there we're having a fun time and just kind of enjoying it so hope to see everyone there and I don't know when the next video is going to be but hopefully not not too long after this one <laughs> thank you guys and I hope everyone is having a fantastic 2021 where you move make me blind you will always be there there's no doubt in my mind you will always be